Nikki, and this is how you dye extensions. This tutorial is sponsored by Uni Wigs. They provided these extensions for free. I'll be using these blonde extensions to dye them red. Here they are. They seem rather thin right now, but they are actually thicker than they appear. They're very silky, soft, and smooth. They're also human hair, which is a very important thing to note for synthetic fibers will not take to hair dye. These extensions attach with comb clips in a line of wefts. The clip sections range from two to four. This is the color of my hair, and the color will be dyeing the extensions. I dye my hair using products from Sally's Beauty, and will be using the same products and methods to dye the extensions in order for them to match my hair. Here are all the ingredients to mix the hair dye. I'm using three boxes of hair dye, 30 developer, a measuring bottle, a mixing bowl, and a brush. I've also laid down an old shopping bag to protect my coffee table. The process to mix all the hair dye is simple. The dye I use has a one-to-one -one ratio of dye to developer. I'm using three boxes of dye, so I'm tripling the amount of developer. I measured the appropriate amount of developer in the measuring bottle, then I combine all ingredients in the bowl and mix with the brush. I mix until the mixture is combined to a smooth texture. The bowl I used is a bit too small for this job, but it worked out, but in hindsight, I do wish I had gotten a bigger bowl. With the dye mixed, I move on to applying it to the extensions. To do this, lay out your extensions on your work surface. Be sure it's something you don't mind getting messy or ruined, and brush out the product into the hair, starting from the base of the weft, then drag it down. Do this for both sides of the weft, and add more product to areas that don't seem fully covered. Rinse and repeat for all the wefts you want to dye. Also, be sure to get all of this covered with the hair dye, including the weft line. You're going to want all of this the same color so it doesn't show in your hair later. After all your extensions have dye on them, roll them up in cute little hair balls and allow the product to develop. Once they're done developing, or are the color you desire, take your little hair balls and thoroughly rinse them out in a sink or faucet of some kind. I used my bathtub because it was easiest. When you rinse all of the dye out, be sure to shampoo and condition them. When you're done, roll them in a towel to squeeze out all excess moisture. Allow them to air dry or blow dry. Then you're done. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. I hope it's helpful to anyone who's looking to dye some extensions. I love these extensions. They're easy to put in, maintain, and look really natural. I would really recommend uni wigs to anyone who's looking for some good extensions that aren't crazily priced. Thanks again so much, and bye!